it's been awesome. When I got here like 15 minutes before polls open, there was already a line forming and um, the parking lot has been full. The turnout seems really great, um, which is so exciting to see. And uh, I think folks are really excited to get in and cast their ballot. So it's been nice getting to greet some neighbors and say hi to folks as they come in before work. Awesome. I'm really excited to push forward some um, sort of key renter protections that have been on the docket for some time now, um, specifically just cause eviction, protection from no cause evictions. Um, so that's something that's really top of mind for me. Um, also getting a statewide rental registry um, is something that I think there's some momentum for and would be a, a huge benefit to, to folks statewide, both renters and, and landlords. Uh, oh my gosh, what's her name? Martine Larakulik. Um, she's one of the state senators um, that's up right now and she's, yeah, I'm really excited for her. She was my French teacher in high school and she's oh, awesome. Sweet. So yeah, it's super cool to see her on the ballot and actually vote for somebody I know personally. <laughs> yeah, that is cool. Yeah. I'm super thrilled uh, to vote for president and vice president. Sweet. Uh, I came here because it sounded fun. <laughs> yeah. Too many people have um, sacrificed their lives so that we can vote, so you have to cast your vote. Sweet. Yeah. yeah. Voting is vital to our democratic system. And why do you feel that way? Because the system only works if we participate in it. Sweet. So we have to participate. Up and down ballot, small races, big races, they're all very important. Uh, civic duty, uh, we all have a part to play in this community and it's important that everybody shows up, especially younger people. Uh, it's very a lot of important things on each election ballot every year. and. The more young people that we can get active and get mobile to get out and actually, you know, do their part, the more important it is, I guess. Uh, it's more of a moral support for the rest of the country to see all the votes for the candidates that I want. And it's not much of a decision. But in Vermont, we don't have as much say as some of these swing states, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but there was a lot of statewide on there, too, and I liked voting for them, too. Women couldn't vote for a long time, so there's that. And maybe women won't be able to vote again, too, if things go sideways today. Yeah. And I'm kind of excited about the local election, and I would vote in it anyhow, but um, I got to say, I'm, honestly, I wish that there was another candidate besides Bernie that we could vote for because I just think he's too old, he's too white, and he's too male. <laughs> and it's just time, like it's time for him to move on. Um, and I wish there was, um, I know there's another, there are two other candidates. Um, and I just wish that we had a better third party system in this country where there could be more choices than just the two. Time to be a grown up. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just, looking around at the world and realizing that I really do need to jump in and make my voice heard. Anyone that's listening, if you're thinking that you don't matter, you just really do. You really do matter, every single one. And I can't, I can't stress that enough because I didn't believe it for the longest time and here I am, now I do.